Asia, Gitta Donvig and Port Said 10. Um, Gitta, the daughter of Australian team rider Mary Hanna, on Mary and Rob Hanna's Port Said, beautiful square halt. So starting on a strong mark, Gitta Donvig from Victoria. A little behind the vertical through the corner into the extended trot. Trot half past right could be more balanced in the corner. Well forward, perhaps could find more balance and cadence. Maybe there's a little speed, too much speed here. A little more collection, coming to the halt for the rein back. Almost square, right hind back a little. Not diagonal at first, often those two things coincide. And Gitta encouraging him to go actively forward into the trot. Extended trot, nice beginning. Could now reach a little more forward to the contact, but good ground cover, a little more balance there coming back at V. And the passage, could do a little more today from behind. Just a bit tight, but accurate in the Piaf, clearly sitting behind, could be even more constant to the contact, clean transition. Just a little tight in the passage, could produce a little more spring off the ground into the extended walk now. Port Said relaxing. And now coming back to the collected walk, remaining through the pole. Clear change in the length of stride. A little right flexion at all times, perhaps a little exaggerated. Coming up the transition to passage at M. Some hesitation produced just a tiny bit early. And now in the passage, again, Port Said could step more under the weight to, to go for an even higher mark in passage. Coming into the Piaf. Well done. And a clean transition, then slightly interrupted, but the actual transition was there. The passage, he's just holding fast a little today. He could let more through the pole and swing more through the body. Smoothly to the canter. An elegant collected canter. Now for the two time changes. Straight. Covering ground. Gita would be pleased there, and I'm sure the judges are too. He could be a little more forward to the contact here on the short side. Extended canter again, confidently begun. So producing some good work in the canter. Gita Donvig and Port Said 10. Uphill change. Perhaps more clear transition to collection before. Really going for the flexion to the left and also producing to the right. So risk and accuracy at this point in the zigzag. Whoops, small, small interruption there, small loss of balance. Um, rider's decision, go for the high mark, go for the, the eight or more. And I do think Gitter was taking that risk there in the zigzag into the ones, off to a confident start and then an interruption. It's a shame there, we'll see some, some big marks and then unfortunately there's a couple of little mistakes to take, uh, to take the overall score down. Counter pirouette left, quite small. Could be even more through the body and a little more out to the contact. Counter pirouette right, starting very small. Well done, Gitta. Well performed. 
pulling another big mark there and the counter pirouette right. Pirouettes times two. There we go on to the collected trot and transition to extension. Could be a little more out to the bridle and more balance coming back at K. It's been a, a slight weakness today um, coming back from the extended trots. Transition into the passage, just taking some time to develop the passage this time. And now what has been a highlight coming up, the Piaf. Yes, she's not quite with Gitter, but she's very professionally managed to keep his focus just enough and into the passage. There we go, passage is there cleanly again and the final halt, square halt. Well done, Gitter Donvig, Port Said 10. Representing Australia from Victoria, Gita Donvig and Port Said 10. So, Silvery and Anne Slatford were up into fourth place. What can Gitter do? Northern Hector, Blas Lago into fifth. Uh, I'm sorry, I can announce Fisherman's Friend Tor Vandenberg has moved into fifth place with a score of 63.96. Congratulations to Tor. Judge at E, 66.6. .6. Judge at H, 63.19. Judge at C, 61.38. Judge at M, 64.26. And Judge at B, 64.36. Mm -hmm.